Hi, this is Brent Baker from Bill Stasek Chevrolet. You might have just bought your first Stingray and it could be your very first Corvette. So in this video series, we're going to touch on a few hot points as to how better to understand your Stingray and also get the most out of your driving experience. First, we're going to start off with how to take off the target top and put it in the trunk. I've actually spoken to a lot of customers who surprisingly were never taught how to take the roof off and really you never get to enjoy the full driving experience. Let's start off with that by hopping in the cabin. While you're sitting in the cabin of your Corvette Coupe, just go ahead and pull down the sun visors and it'll expose two large clips. Pull the clips back towards yourself and push them out towards the edges of the car. Then on the rear of the roof, there's a single latch. With a finger, push on the front part of the button. You'll hear a pop and the back locking mechanism will come forward. So the roof is released and now we can put it into the trunk. Now that we have the latches undone inside the interior, all we're going to do is first lift from the front of the roof. You're going to see it unseat itself from the rear and just slide your hand into the back side of it while grabbing the front. The roof is fairly light and if you get the painted uh, to match carbon fiber roof, it's actually about half the weight of the old C6 and C5 roofs. This is a transparent roof so it weighs about the same. We're walking on back to the rear of the car and keeping it in the same direction that it was on top of the Corvette, we're just going to gently set it into the car. And there's two hooks on the front of the cargo area that the roof sits in nicely. After they've been seated, just lay the roof down, give it a push, and it clicks right into place. As you can notice, I already had the tailgate open, which is an important step. It's difficult to handle the roof and open the rear hatch at the same time unless you have a helper. Next up, we'll cover some items on the radio to make sure you're comfortable with how the car works.